babe, 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 please. Not this morning. Yeah. Calm down now, and I'll just I'm in the mood already. See, see, but, but I am not in the mood, eh? And you led me on? Of course, um, you woke me up with kisses, so I had to play along to be nice. Okay, try, try, try to be nice, girls. Babe, stop this. Vera, what is this now? Must we fight about this every time? I said I am not in the mood. Please, eh, eh, please, to be. Ah. That's very careless. I'm going to lose my to be, just leave me alone. Ah, what is it? Can somebody not rest in this house? Every time, sex, sex, sex. Hello, Mom. Emma. 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 Yes, Mom. Is today not your birthday? Did you not add one year to your life today? And yet there is no man, no grandchild from my only daughter. Emma, are you not ashamed of yourself? You just turned 35. I mean 35. Emma, you are still single. Mom, it's 35, not 53. I'll marry when I can. Shut up your dating mouth. Were you not the one rejecting suitors? And now it is hard for you to marry. Mom, 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 today is my birthday. It's my birthday. It's how you want to celebrate me. Celebrate you? What about you? Will I celebrate? Vera. Vera, what is this now? I mean, do I have to call a town hall meeting and have, a, I have an agreement with you before I can make love to my... At least both parties have to agree to it. Eh? Or do you want to rape me? I am your husband and you're sex starving me. And I am your wife and not a sex worker. Good morning. Mom, when has marriage become a yardstick for you to measure a woman's achievement? When? I'm 35. For goodness sakes, I'll marry when I can. Hello? Emma? This is Ebuka, the cab driver. I'm outside. Ebuka? Wow, sorry, I, I, I thought it was someone else. No, no, no it's fine. I, I mean, I just wanted to know if you addressed you said you wanted to leave at 6.45 a.m. Oh my God! I'm totally forgot! Hello? Um, Emma, I'm still waiting. I don't know if we're still going. I mean, I have another client to pick up at 9. Look, 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 look. I pay you too much to give me stress, okay?
move to work. Are you not having breakfast? I don't feel like eating. Have a nice day. Really? Is this how we do it now? Even after what you did this morning? Off to work. Hello? V, what's up? Hey, what's up? Happy birthday, girl. <laughs> I wish you more and more opportunities in life. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. You're welcome, darling. Anytime. So, what's up? How will your day be? Uh, um, I, I honestly don't know. I'm actually heading for a meeting until I know what I'm about to do. I have no idea what I'm going to do for the rest of the day. Honestly. Okay, in that case, call me when you're done because I would like to see you later today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I promise I'll let you know. Babe, can I call you back? Please, please, please. Thanks. Hello, sir. Sir, we're just we're three minutes away from me. Three, just. Oh, okay, sir. Right, right, sir. Good. What is it? I'm so sorry. I think the car is overheating. Over what? Uh, okay. I'll just check it out now. I I I, I checked and huh. put water in the morning Ebuka. before I left. To your village people would not. You ha ha! Are you kidding me right now? Are you serious? I'm one hour behind schedule. I, I wouldn't take time, please. What kind of Hello? Yes, yes, I, yeah, I just booked you. I see you are two minutes away. No, 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 don't worry, don't worry. You can't you can reverse here. I'll just walk up to you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. This now. Excuse me, ma'am, please, please, please. If you can just allow it to cool a bit, I'll add water. Madam! God, 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 trouble is this, this early morning now. What is this one? Ah, did she forget her documents? I said, Madam! Madam! Sir, I'm so, I'm so sorry. Sir, my deepest apologies. Look, you were supposed to meet an hour ago. You yes, are sir. late. Yes, sir. Uh, it's the great luck that was on the road. Um, Lagos roads can be very unpredictable, but I'm, I'm, I'm deeply sorry. I... You were supposed to send me your quotation via email. Where is it? Absolutely. Abby suggested I bring it in person for, for easy negotiations and rectification. And so okay. and... Where is it? Um, it's... It, it's... You reek of incompetence. Sir, it's... Good morning, sir. Ah, uh, Ebuka, Abby's cousin, eh? Yes, sir. I hope you are good. Yes, I just read this. Okay, okay. I've been trying to reach you. You forgot this in the car. Do you know what you've cost me? Do you know what your incompetence has cost me? I... Because of you, I have lost a contract, an interior deco contract for this company worth 22 million naira. Because of your 
incompetence. But I didn't know. I do not ever want to see you again. Do not call me name. Bella, how could I have paid the rent now when this guy keeps stressing me? I'm tired. This guy is stressing me out, man. Ebuka, this house is our only place and hope of shelter. All thanks to you. S stop sounding like that now. I will sound any how I like to put sense in your head. Watch your mouth, Bella. I'm still your elder brother. Elder brother, my foot. Do you even behave like you sold everything we had, all in the name of your traveling to Canada for a better life. And all you got was a fake visa to Dubai that landed you in jail, oh. Ebuka, I sold everything I had to get you out of that jail. Ebuka, your only duty was to pay the rent of this house. And that you have failed woefully. It's fine. I'll pay the rent. Because the landlord just left here now and he gave us just four weeks. Four weeks to move out if we don't pay our debts. What? He, he brought a notice. Why would he do that? Ebuka. Ebuka. <laughs> I will never forgive you if you let this happen. I will never. Oh. Ebuka. <laughs> Hey, Abe. Good afternoon. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you so much, Abe. I owe you one, man. I owe you one. Thank you. You can't blame the cabman if you ask me. So who should I blame? Huh? Because of him now, I've lost that contract. And I've been working on it for two months, Vera. Two months. Emma, why are you misfiring? I'm misfiring. Yes, because according to you, you said you woke up late, <laughs> wasted time while you were looking for a file. You're supposed to have kept somewhere you can easily pick up, knowing you have to be punctual. Yeah. Eh? See, if you had left earlier, when that car um, overheated, you would have picked up another car and, and made it for your meeting. Yeah. Vera, why was he driving a faulty car? How would why? he have known? Eh? <laughs> And by the way, why are you not even driving? Why, why haven't you started driving? Because of my PTSD. Because of the accident, I've not started oh. driving. Oh, that. Oh, that. Anyway, you just have to cheer up because it's your day. <laughs> and it's not the end of the world. Wow. Tell my mom that because she already ruined it for me today. Reminding me that I don't have a man yet, you know? That she's disappointed. <sighs> Isn't marriage overrated? Hmm. I'm going to tell her that for me. Did I not want you to not call my phone again? Who was that? Not a stupid driver. And what does he want? Mm -hmm. I am so not in the mood. Who is that one again? Oh, today I'm really not in the mood. I'm really not in the mood. Ebuka, hey, you know what? It's your audacity for me. I I've been trying to reach you. Did I not tell you not to come near me, not to contact me? Because of you, I lost the contract worth 22 million naira. I, I'm really sorry about that, but I think you should check your email. What? They sent you a contract. Oh, you. There's nothing here. There's nothing here. Nothing. Nothing. But they... They said they sent it. No. <gasps> yeah. I got the contract. How is 
as possible. Actually, my, my cousin, Abby, works for the company. And she happens to be one of her boss's favorite staff. After you left, Ed, I met with her and asked her to put in a word for you, which she did. She just simply told her boss that you would be one of the best for the contract. Voila, here we are. I can't believe this. Ibuka, thank you. You don't know how much this means to me. No, thank no, you. No, no, it's, it's your birthday and I didn't want to be the one to ruin it, so... Thank you so much. I mean, isn't this the best gift of the day? Yes. Coming from someone you said you don't know when to see again. I just had to say that. Look, I am I'm so sorry. My my outbursts earlier was completely unnecessary. The, the words I said to you, I shouldn't have said them. No, 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 it's fine. I mean, you were under pressure, so I totally understand. Yes, I was. I, was. I apologize, I said to them. Okay. okay. Um, okay. You know what? Give me a minute, I'll be right back. Oh, what? Just one minute. Okay, okay. Babe. Babe. Can you believe this? Like, is this real? Who would have thought that a mare driver can be of help? <laughs> I can't believe this. <laughs> that guy is um, not that bad. Okay. If you ask me. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? what you heard you me. Happy birthday, dear Emma. <laughs> oh my God. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. For me? Pizza. <laughs> Thank you. Happy birthday and a big congrats on your new um, contract. <laughs> Thank you so much. I mean, I figured you like pizza a lot instead of getting your cake today. It'd be good to mm. get you Thank your you favorite. so much. Like, I don't even know what's going on right now because it should be the other way around. I should be the one buying you gifts to, to, to thank you for the contract and here you are. No, no, it's your birthday. You should be the one receiving gifts, right? <laughs> this is so nice, eh? Yes, yes. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I think it's my mom. Oh. Yeah? Why? Can't you wait a little longer? Okay. Girl, I have to run, eh? You're not serious. My mom just brought some stuff to the house and she wants to see me ASAP. Now? Yeah. Okay, we'll see you in the evening, I guess. Alright, dear Shell. <laughs> um, I have your number, right? I wouldn't know. Okay, call it for me then. Go, because go, go. I might be needing your service. Yeah, yeah. Go, go. <laughs> Bye. I'm sorry. I'm no, sorry. No, no, no. Oh, good. Um, please sit, sit. I still need to get going. You too? No, no, I, I still have work. It's still <laughs> just past midday. Have you fixed your car? Yes, it was not, it was a problem, just the radiator leaking, so... You see? It's, it's, so you need to buy a new one? More reason I need to go back to work so I can make more money <laughs> to buy a new one. Come on, take a seat, chill with me, it's my birthday. Let's celebrate my success, my contract, you know? And, 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 and you know, I, I can insist it's my birthday. And besides, I can pay you for the whole day. You know, so you don't have to work. No. I insist. No. I'll pay you, I'll pay you. It's done. Yes, it's my birthday. You don't have to pay me, it's fine. I'll, I'll stay. <laughs> Please come That's in. The, just come one in. hour. The whole day. That's the deal. Come and have a seat. I will work up something for us to eat and we can just play. Oh my god. Alright, sounds good. Yeah. Birthday girl. Thank you. <laughs> so you didn't have any other plans for today? Well, somebody almost ruined my day, so. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> I had to rub it in. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> What are you doing here? I thought I'd ask you to wait while I walk up something for us to eat. Well, it was becoming quite boring just sitting there in the living room. <laughs> Besides, I thought it would be great to come and teach you a thing or two in the kitchen. You know what I think? 
I think that you do not trust my cooking. I didn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> Plus, I, I haven't found anyone who cooks better than I do. Really? It's the confidence for me, with a hint of arrogance. <laughs> you want to try? I dare you. You want us to try? Yes. <laughs> Okay, so how do I help? <laughs> it's okay. you that knows everything. I'll just create this for you. Okay. Nice. <laughs> you gotta tell me, eh? Uh, me and Kuku. Are you sure you're trying that thing well? Oh, my mom <laughs> taught me well. Yeah, that'd be wrong. No, it's this way. Thank you. <laughs> Oh yeah. Take my cabman. Now let's chess. To mad fun, good times, and good. You know, just. I'm just, not. I'm, fine. That's my girl. <laughs> but how are you going to insinuate my cab guy? I mean, I know I'm lonely, but I'm not that lonely. Uh, my cab guy, really. Girl, stop it. Eh? <sighs> there is nothing wrong in that. By the way. How was it? No, 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 You're not going to make me do that. <laughs> no, V, no details. I'm not splodging. No, no, there is no way you're going to deny me all the juicy details. I wouldn't take that for an answer. No v, way. Start talking. I... I am all ears, girl. Start talking. See, by the way, I'm sure you had mad fun because. See that? Don't glow. do that. Don't do that. I can see the glow. Girl, start talking. Babes, fine. Gosh. Okay. I'm listening. He. He just, you know, he knows. 
Let's just say he knows his way around the woman's anatomy. That's all I'm going to say. That's oh all. Oh my God. You don't mean it. Girl, let me have his contact. Where's my phone? Let me have his contact. <laughs> <laughs> You're serious? Of course, yes. We oh, know you're married. And so? <laughs> <laughs> Please ever forget that. Spare me. We! <laughs> okay. You know what? Hands off. <sighs> Good. You know, I don't even understand what kind of friend I have. You should be, you should give me a first class ticket to Hades but girl, or something, but fun. you had fun. Stop it. Somebody stop me. it. Stop oh, acting I... like a kid. Why do you constantly look for the slightest opportunity to remind me of the one time I have failed in my life? That one time that cost us too many. Ebuka. Mm. Now let me remind you. You haven't failed in life yet. Now I, now you never shine. And for that, eh? No shame, they shame me. Why are you even talking like this? Am I not doing my best? Huh? Am I not? Are you not doing your best? Ibuka, your best is not good enough. I mean, Bella, I leave this house early every morning. I return sometime by 12 midnight, 1 a.m. sometimes, just to put food on our table, just to, show, to do, do the most I can. And still it's not enough. Ebuka, this is Lagos. Hold up, no go let hard work pay you. Now smart work. Now I go pay you. So in other words, you'd... You'd rather that I double into illegal businesses? Uh-huh. And so? No be your mates, they do am. Hey, Buka. No be your mates, they do am. Oh, wait, though. So you think say this is your kabu kabu work? You go fit change our lives. <laughs> hey, Buka. <laughs> you better do something, oh. You better because I, Bella, I cannot and will not be homeless. <laughs> I can't even believe you right now. I can't. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I just said my piece. Hi, babe. What are you doing? I'm trying to wipe off my makeup. Oh, okay. So, um, I've got a puzzle for you. Choose one of these hands. Whatever you see is yours. Babe, you know I'm not good at guessing. Just try it. Okay. Mm, this? There's nothing in it. You see? So, I got you this. My God. Beep. Ah. Beep, you got this for me. You, you like it? I love it. Thank you. So I was passing by a good shop. I thought I should get you this. Uh-uh. You got the best. Come here. So can we now do... Beep, 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 beep. Please, I am not in the mood, eh? I told you in the morning now, eh? Don't worry, I'll make it up to you. Babe, babe, I am your husband. I mean, this is not fair. What? It's not like we don't have sex at all. We have sex only when you want it. And it's not like it's even the best sex I can talk about. Oh, <laughs> wow. So you now have side chicks that give sex to you better than I do? Eh? And you now compare theirs with mine? Maybe that's the best thing to do. Because I don't understand why my wife cannot even carry out the list of our bedroom obligations. Take it. Take it. I don't need it anymore. I won't have you talk to me that way. You're such a maniac. We have sex once in a month in this house and I'm a maniac.
we have sex once in a month in this house and I'm a maniac. Me. Who did I marry? So make a conjure make up for Siski. <laughs> her location is not bad. My idea where ya? Hmm. How much I can't pay for transport? Now. <laughs> but babe, come on. That's not fair. You know what I'm talking about. I don't care. You don't care. What if another woman is giving it to him? I will kill him if he ever tries to. Are you serious right now? But then give it to him now. Because you know he's your husband and he's, he's, he's right anyway. You sound like I don't give it to him at all. Well, because I know you and I know you like it a lot. So why are you depriving him? <sighs> Did he... Pay you to convince me. <laughs> eh? No. All I'm saying is that you're not being fair to him. See, can we change this topic, please? No, no. What I'm wondering is, if you didn't like his touch, but you liked his money, then why didn't you just grab as much as you wanted and let the poor guy be instead of making his life miserable? Emma, boundaries, please. And the last time I checked, you were not... A therapist. But I'm your friend. Emma. 
Wow. Okay. I have to go. I'll call you. Bibabe, sit down, Joe. No. Because I, I yield to stop you from meddling with my marital affair. I beg, sit down, Joe. I have this appointment. I Which appointment? Okay, fine. I am sorry I yield. But you know I'm telling you the truth, right? See, we are not doing this again. Please. God, you're impossible. By the way, how is um, our cab guy? When last did you see him? Wait, how did we go from that to that? <laughs> I don't know. I, I, I haven't been taking his calls and I haven't seen him after then. Why? Why? Because he's a cab driver and I, I don't want to lead him on, you know? Nothing's going to come out of it. Why do you think so? He's a cab driver! Bipsy, that guy is handsome and looks driven. Hmm. Trust me, a little lift can turn him into the man of your dreams. He's handsome, but that's not what I'm going to eat. You know, he's not my type, he's not... Okay, fine. In that case, um, can we share? Are you serious right now? Vera! Here I am trying to convince you to sleep with your own husband. But you're willing to pat your legs for it. Cab driver. Bipsy, that man understands the anatomy of a woman, unlike my husband. Then teach your husband. Ask what? Do you want him to see me as a sex teacher? Ha! Ah. So you would think I do worst behind him? What you Please do come now? up it. You do, so... Babes, hmm? whose side are you on? You're my friend, remember? Mm -hmm. You know what? You're right. Let's change the topic, okay? Yeah, so... <laughs> um, have you Not sourced a makeup artist for our event tomorrow? Are we making up ourselves? <laughs> anyway, I have seen one on IG. And I think I like her work. So you booked her? No, I'll call her. Her number is on IG anyway, so let me just call her right away. But babes, please, you have to get your things here. Yeah? Really? So you can leave after the face bit. Oh, I didn't think of that. Please. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, let me search for a number. I'll give it in person, I'll go see. I will not speak this call. I'm sure it's the landlord that is trying to call me to another number. This, this must be client though. Eh? Call that big now. I run this thing for me now. Just take her back. Hello? Hello? Yes, ma. Yes, ma. Ma, if you want me to come and do home service for you anywhere on the island, it's 20,000 naira, ma. Where? VGC. Yes, my can do it, ma. You and your friend. Yes, ma. My can do it, ma. Thank you, ma. Thank God. Uh, at least I could use this one to support my brother with rent.
What is it? Nothing. She's fine. Ebuka, what's the matter? I said nothing. I'm fine. It's nothing. You don't look fine to me. Is it money or...? I said nothing! I hope you know that the only thing that should be bothering you now is, is money for our rent. Take nothing. Hey, hey babes. <laughs> Welcome. How about she's not here yet? No, she actually called a few minutes ago. But she'll be here soon. Well, soon. You have Happy to qualify sis. soon. When? Today? <laughs> next year? I don't know. Whatever. The fact still remains that she's coming. She's on her way, girl. So relax. Ah, okay. Oh, what am I to complain? I mean, I'll just be here on my yellow throne. Anyways, I beg, <laughs> please, um, can I have some juice to quench my thirst? And please put some ice in it. You know, I don't like it to look warm. And if there's strawberry, you know, I like it red, red slices. Yeah, not yeah. The pink don't, ones. don't worry yourself. Just relax. Oh, you get you. it, okay? I know you got me. You got me. You got me. I got you, girl. <sighs> You got me. You got me. <laughs> <laughs> no worries, it for me. You get it to the next um, fifteen weeks. Are you Nonsense. serious right now? I don't blame you. Savage. <laughs> like you're a stranger in this house, like you, girl. You, you, you touched the innermost part of my heart. <laughs> and you said you got me. You got me. I came yeah. all the way from my house. I don't care. I don't care. So what time are we leaving? Well, we still have four hours to the time. That's a lot of time. <laughs> are you serious? Yeah, babe, so relax. Oh, gosh. Morning, you must be Bella. Where's your box? My brother is bringing it. Oh. Okay. So you can start setting up now. So we don't run late. Mm -hmm. Good morning. Bella. Ma? Is this your brother? Yes, Ma. Really? Um, I, I will be on my way now. Um, um please, um, don't be in a hurry to leave, okay? You can sit and have some drink. That wouldn't be necessary. I already have an order. Thanks for offering, though. Um, fine. If you don't mind, can I have your number? Um, for your service, if I don't feel like driving. Give her your number now. Don't you want clients? Especially one like this. Bella, <laughs> I think we'll be friends for a long time. I don't mind, Ma. Don't worry, I'll give you his number. Thank you. So let me have it then. Sure. Um, I'll be on my way. Thank you, brother. Bella, your brother is so cute. Thank you very much. He's also single. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Don't worry, we'll talk. Sure. Just set, set up. Set I'll up. call you. Emma, what is it? What's going on, Ma? Never mind, okay. Just set up, set up. 
let's do this. Are you sure? Fine, everything is fine. Just go on, go on with the makeup. Okay, ma. It's fine. Is this place okay, ma? Yeah, it is. Hello, good afternoon. Who is it? You deserve any better? Please. Please do not call this number again. Epuka, Epuka, wait. Look, I'm sorry. I, I really miss you. You're sorry? Yet you avoided me like a plague, like I meant nothing to you. Do you know what I've been through? This work, I don't know which other work you're talking about. <laughs> besides, besides, this is the only work you need to be doing. And I'll pay for the rest of the day, so you can thank me later. Oh. Oi, try, try. What? Why do you keep doing this? Making you happy? No, like... I don't get it. Anytime we get together mm -hmm. and, you know, make love, you pay me for it. It just makes me feel like a sex worker. Whoa. Like all I am to you is that cab driver that is always at your beck and call whenever you want sex. This means a lot to me. Ebuka, that's not true. But that's how I feel. <sighs> okay. Look. The feeling is mutual. I don't even know what this is. Okay? I'll be frank. But one thing I'm sure about is... Whenever I'm with you, I cherish every moment, and I mean every moment that we spend together. You know? It doesn't seem like it. It doesn't. Come on. <clears throat> Can we let it flow? Can we... Hey, look at me. Can we stop thinking about it too much? Listen, from the very first day you booked my ride and stepped into my car, I had the spark. I, I didn't know what it was at first, but now I know. And I'm grateful to God for orchestrating it. And when you said you wanted me to be your permanent driver, I was ecstatic, babe. <laughs> I was. And trust me, Emma, I enjoy 
driving you around town. And trust me, I would love to do it for the rest of my life. If you let me. Uh -huh. If you let me. Come to your car. Run. Why do we find love in the strangest places? And why do we keep creating boundaries against something as beautiful as this? Hmm? Hey, how do I look? You look amazing. Thank you. I love your dress. Thank you. And you know what? You did justice to my face. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you so much. And by the way, did you get your money? Uh, yes, my, I got it. You tripled it. Why? <laughs> yes, um, and there is more to where that came from. If you can link me up with your brother. Ma, I'll talk to him. That's not a problem at all. Um, maybe you can start by doing him a favor. Our rent has expired and our landlord has been threatening fire and brimstone. Wow. How much is it? Um, it's 600 kima. But we've stayed for like 15 months without pay, so it's 750,000. Uh, fine. In that case, um, I will give him one millionaire if he agrees to be my side piece. And 200K will be sent to you if you can talk to him. Huh. Mm -hmm. And by the way, don't forget, you're now my permanent makeup artist from now. Auntie. <laughs> Are you for real? I am serious. I am not missing words. Ma, it's all yours. Just relax. If you even grease it, I'll go shake calabash from your head. Mm, I like you already. Anyway, just pack up, okay? So I just drop you off here. You can get a cap. Yes, ma. Okay, hurry up. Hey. <laughs> Hey, Buka. This woman is ready to change our lives. One million naira. One million naira. And our rent is just 750,000. Hey, Buka. Open your eyes now because of my brother. How can you be pushing me to sleep with a married woman? Married woman that wants to help. This woman is ready to take us out of this mess that you put us into. You have been driving from January till now, yet no tangible thing to show for it. I don't understand, Ibuka. Do you, do you want us to be homeless? Can you stop with the pressure? I mean, would you just let me handle this rent the best possible way I can? Let me, I will work extra hours. I would get a new job if need be, but please stop with the pressure, enough of it. What do you think Mama would have said if she was still alive? Ibuka. Mama would have been ashamed of you. Mm. Ibuka, I warned you. I warned you about that fake visa agent, but you wouldn't listen. You sold everything we had, yet you landed yourself in jail. I, Bella, 
I sold everything I had to pay you. Ebuka. Ebuka. If I end up homeless in this merciless city of Lagos, I will never forgive you. Never. Where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going? <laughs> mm -hmm. You're not leaving. You're not leaving now. I, I wanted to talk to you about something. Okay, sit, sit. My phone is ringing. Sit, don't leave. Don't leave. I'm coming. Hello, Mom. Mm-hmm. Mom, look, I, I am not that financially buoyant now. I, I, I can't help you. I would love to, but it's not going as I've... Okay, can I call you back on this? Please? Thank you. Oh God, I think I am an ATM machine. <sighs> Sorry, so... What did you want to talk to me about? Sorry. Uh, it, um, <clears throat> I, I was just wondering. Is everything okay? Yeah, 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 of course. Okay. I was just thinking that um, I, I'll need to start earning better. I don't, I don't know if it will come from a different job or you just, you know, thinking out loud. I oh, know. Yeah. Babes, don't worry. I mean, I know you. You will do better. And besides, I hope you know you're going to get something out of that contract money. Wow. Really? <laughs> yeah, duh. <sighs> uh, that, that, that's cool. <laughs> um, so, like, how much are we looking at here? Um, 10%, which, by the way, is 2.2 million Naira. Oh, that's, that's actually a lot. Of course it's a lot. <laughs> um, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So, any idea when uh, they are looking at making first installment? Well, the house is in its final stage, so let's say two months. Hmm, not bad. <laughs> Fingers crossed then. No, don't keep them crossed. Keep them definite. It's a definite, definite. I'm coming. Let me go and finish what I saw in the kitchen before you distract me. You know you always have a way of distracting me. I really now I'm a distraction. Yes, you are. Yeah, come in. Yeah? Where's the gate? So you can see the road. The road is very good. Eh? Uh, water. There's water. Omiwa. Put here. Even uh, light. Light, there's no problem. There's light all the wow. time. Eh? So you have no problem with the house. Right. Eh? So everything is okay. Uh, this is the, that's the apartment there. Wow. Yeah. Uh, who is there? Oga. Okay. Yes. This is this house. Ah, don't worry. You are living in 14 days. Then you don't have a problem. Wait. Uh -huh. Oga, okay, landlord. Uh, how are you? Uh, look, I've told you and your brother, back out of my house. I don't want trouble. I don't want you and your brother again in my house. Please leave my house. Two weeks is what I've given to you people. Two weeks. After two weeks, leave my house. Oga, I thought you said four weeks. Four? That is when I don't have clients. Now I have it. I have it. Look at my client here. You people should leave my house. Leave my house, please. I don't want trouble. Leave my house. Bella, what is your name and your brother? Leave my house. Uh, brother. I hope you, love, you like the compound. I like the compound. Ah. But I don't know how the interior is. Don't worry. Interior? Ah, that is where I finished the whole. Come, let's move and show you this. Oga, landlord, you cannot enter inside. Ah. 
not when we are still the occupants of this house. Leave my room. Oh, God, landlord. Baba. You will not like me. Yes. I think we should, we should start going. Go where? Maybe when the house is... Maybe when you settle... No, 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 no. I'm not leaving this place. This is my house. Okay. You can call This me. is my house. Still have my number. Bolona. Come here. You call me when you're, when you're done. Thank have you seen what you have cost? Have you seen what you have cost? Oh, God, landlord. You are pushing me. Oh, God, landlord. You are pushing me. You will not like me this place, oh. You will not like me. You will leave my house. You are your brother. You will leave. Today. And my crew will leave me. You will leave my house. Hey! She pushed me. Could you ever tell her? You will leave my house, oh. Hey! You pushed me. Ah! You will leave my house. My crew will leave me. Ah! Tell your brother that you will leave my house today. Hey! She pushed me. Allah. Come, come, brother. Hey! Back like dog. I want to enter house that we are still living in. Hello, Ron. How are you? I'm good, and you? You don't sound good. What is it? I'm okay, ma. Bella, you can talk to me. Bella. He's actually putting us through hell because of the unpaid rent. Then convince your brother. I hear of how good he is in bed. And I want to have a taste of his poise. Who told you that? My friend. The one you saw when you came to my place. Is that why she was acting the way she did? of what you did because you're married. No, she's just being jealous. She wants to have him all to herself. But I will never let that happen. Then she should help my brother. Why is she that stingy? I wouldn't know. Sibella, you are a woman, okay? Use your persuasive strength on him. My offer won't be here for too long. Vera, what is going on? I'm talking to you, Vera, what is really going on? I mean, how can I have a wife of my spec and sexual fantasies here to touch you? I have to make plans or even go, go, go through a, a plan. Who does that? Toby, you locked the door. Yes, I did. And we have to find a solution to this or none of us is sleeping this night. What solution, Toby? Eh? Is it my fault that I am not into this sex thing like you are? You are my partner and it's your obligation to satisfy my demands. Even when I am not up to it. Vera, I'm, how do you even stay one week, two weeks, even one month without satisfying my request? Are you okay with that? See, Toby, there is no way I'm going to do this with you. Now open the door. You will. And I have to enjoy I, my wife like if I, 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 Nonsense! You think you can rap me? No way! Now, where's the key? Where is the key? Please, can I get the food now? I'm really hungry. What food? When I was leaving, I gave you some money to make dinner. I didn't use it. That's your money. I cannot cook for a fool. 
What's the meaning of this now? You watch the way you talk to me. Wait. What name will you call a man that has time for frivolities at the verge of being ejected from his house? No be mumu be that. You will not talk to me in that manner, Bella. You will not talk to me like that. As if you deserve any respect. We are in a big mess. But all you care about is building a relationship, eh? But wait. Why not ask the same girl for help? I don't understand. I should ask someone I literally just said a scene for help. Mm -hmm. That is what any desperate person in your situation would do. I'm, I'm not very comfortable with that. I mean, I, I can't start asking her for financial assistance. It would seem as though that's why I'm with her in the first place. Uh -huh. What other reason do you have to be with her at this point of your life? <sighs> well, it's not like it hasn't crossed my mind. I actually was going to do that, but it seems like she she doesn't have a lot of money at the moment. She had said that as soon as she gets deposit for the contract, I will get my own court. Meaning that I will not even need to borrow from her anyways. Wait, oh. Is she the same girl that Abby told me you begged her to talk to her boss for? Yes. Oh. And when is this contract? In three months. Three months? I would have been kicked out of the house by then now. Eh? Hey, Buka, why not just do this thing with Vera? If Vera is a married woman. That is not the reason why you don't want to do it with her. You don't want to do this because she's your girl's bestie. Not because she's married. If you're hell-bent on me sleeping with a married woman for money, how about you do the same thing you're asking me to do? Go and sleep with my brain as well. I should sell my body again. Does it make any difference? Like I sold my body and helped you to travel. And you foolishly landed in the hands of a fraudster. Like I sold my body to bail you out of jail. You came out. And you became a Cabo Cabo driver who cannot even pay his rent. All you do now is insult me. With every slight chance you get, you rain abuses on me. No problem. I'll go and look forward to it. Vera, I married you because I love you. And I believe you love me too. Are we here for the wrong reasons? Every time I touch you, you act like my body, my breath, and everything about me irritates you. Meanwhile, I've been with other women even before I married you, and this was never the case. Chobi, the fact still remains that you tried to rape me. Me, Vera. <laughs> this is really funny. I don't blame you. It's not your fault. See, I'm Thanks. really so sorry about this. This is not me. But Vera, think about it. We've been married for two years. Two years, no child. And we're both fed out. Doesn't that bother and you? And do we have to do it every day for us to have kids? Come on! Do we even do it for once in a week? I mean, it's been two months since the last time I slept with you. 
Well, don't you think you're pushing me into the hands of another woman? And if I start, I may not be able to stop. Another woman? Try me. Just try me if you will not get it hot in this house. Nonsense, another woman. I hate the fact I love you this much. But trust me, I'm losing it. Nonsense. See who is raping somebody. Okay. Okay. Emanuela, <laughs> hey, you know, a long time. Shania, what are you doing here? I thought you were based in Abuja. Oh, yes, but my billionaire boyfriend stays in Lagos and I'm here often. Oh, really? <laughs> You're not looking bad yourself. I know you don't great suits me like really well. <laughs> <laughs> Who is he? Your boyfriend? Oh, no, no. He's my driver. You know, I had this thing, this PTSD oh. thing after my accident. So I had to get a driver. So he, he drives me around. Yeah. Anyway, that's good. Yeah. Um, you know, so who are you dating now? Because I know you got eyes for big boys. <laughs> you know me, I don't kiss and tell. Yeah. <laughs> All right, know. so I'll see you um, on IG as usual. Oh, yeah. fine. Yeah. Bye, then. Uh, all right, driver. <laughs> Bye. Bye. All right, so let's go. <clears throat> hey, Buka. You knew how important the mission I was going to is, and yet you left with my documents. Hello? Hello? Did it? Did he cut the line on me? I was already here. There was no need for the long talk. My document, please. Wow. <laughs> Fine. Your driver? Really? I'm sorry. Isn't that your occupation? Is that all I mean to you? Look, Ibuka, I don't know what this is, okay? So until I'm certain what this is, yes, you're my cab driver. You don't know what this is? I, I, I thought we had something going on. I mean, we professed love to each other, like, you got jealous that your friend was trying to get my number. You gave me a lot of green light. Was all that a fluke? Like, how come you don't know what this is anymore? Are you toiling with my feelings? Is it that my feelings do not mean anything to you? Do you think this is easy for me? Look, look at me. I went to the best schools. Okay? I went to school with the sons and daughters of the elite. And, and, and the best I can do is settle down with a cab driver. I mean, duh. I don't know. Wow. Emma. Look, Ebuka, I love you, okay? I love you, but love is not enough. Love will never be enough, especially when the odds are against us. I mean, look at you. You can barely pay your own rent. It is, it's what it is. So... All I am to you is a sex toy. I didn't say that. An emotional wall that you can lean on at your convenience, at your leisure. That's what I am to you.
You know what? Lose my number. I don't want you to ever contact me for anything ever again. I'm out of here. Hello. Hey, Buka, you have done it all. You have done it. Thank you. Thank you so much. God bless you. What, what, is, what is this? Why are you crying, Bella? What happened? The landlord sent his boys and they locked the door. He said we won't take any of our property unless we, we pay what we owe. <sighs> Oh, okay. Wow, wow. Ebuka, you brought me to this shame. Is it a crime to be your sister? Hmm? Is it a crime that I bailed you from the prison in Dubai? Now I am homeless. We are homeless. Um, Bella, I'm so sorry. See, baby says I, I'm really sorry. I didn't mean for any of this to happen. In fact, I'm on my way here. I'll see you in a bit. Huh? Okay, don't, there's no need to cry. I'll, I'll find a solution to this thing. Don't, don't worry. What solution? Eh? What solution exactly, Ebuka? You are the woman that was willing to help us, but you wouldn't let her help us. Because of who? Ebuka? Because of a girl that will never value you, obviously, because both of you are not from the same social class. <laughs> That's actually true. As if I don't know. Hey, look at me, woman. I know how we think. <laughs> now that we are homeless, I hope you're happy. Come on. You know what? Let me just try and talk to a Lord first. I already spoke with one of his dogs. I had to give him my last 3,000 naira. I wanted to use to buy foundation. He said he would let us enter if we can rally round and look for money. We'll be into that tomorrow. Oh. Give me Vera's number. Really?
come on, baby. I've heard of your magic. Indulge me, please. Not without the payment first. Oh, sorry, my bad. <clears throat> um, one millionaire, yeah? Um, make it 1.5 and you can have me more than once. Really? Like my side piece? Well, if you choose to put it that way, yes. Wow. Interesting. I'll make it 1.7 then. That's quite generous. I like you. Always have. And um, your sister, I promised her something. So, done. Now, make me feel the wonders of your touch. Sorry, uh, what, what about your husband? Don't worry, he doesn't come home tonight. And if he has to, he normally calls. Are you sure? Yeah, come on. Security. Where is your madam? She is inside. Why is she not picking up my call? I don't know. Eh, hey, open the gates now. Open now. Oh, Emma, 
For a moment, I thought it was my husband. Where were we? You're not bothered? Why should I be? Hmm? All I want to do right now is to have you again. You know, I like you, not in this. <laughs> Husband? Yes. Emma has told my husband. I thought you said he doesn't come back by this time. Yeah. Huh? Why would Emma tell him? I thought she's my friend. What are you talking about? Goodness. Oh. Um, please tell him you're my cousin, please. Just go, go, go. Go. Vera's cousin. Vera's cousin and I've never seen you before. I've actually been out of the country for a bit, so I just got back. I came to deliver a parcel. I see. Alright, uh, nice to meet you. Okay. Alright, I'll see you some other time. Baby! Baby! What is it Emma told you about me, eh? Why would she lie against me? The guy is my cousin. Oh, Emma never said anything about your cousin. And this your cousin, how come I've never really seen him before? Wait, wait, wait. So what was she talking to you about? Because I am really finding that friendship so uncomfortable right now. She only said that you fought her feelings. You've done something to her that she would never do to you, and at this time she will never forgive you. So, um, she didn't say exactly what I did to her. Well, I didn't bother to ask. Both of you are besties, so I'm sure you'll find a way to figure it out yourself. Don't mind that girl. She wants me to pitch her tent to my cousin, the one that just left now. But I ended up telling my cousin the truth about her. Why? should have allowed them to figure each other out. See, babe, my cousin is my blood. My family. Eh? I won't allow him make such a lifelong mistake. Wait, so Emma is a lifelong mistake? See, babe, let's not just dwell in that, okay? By the way, why are you home early? Well, I had a meeting with a client nearby, so I decided to end my day instead of going to the office and coming back again. Okay. Well, now that you're here, <coughs> I'm going to take care of you. And tonight, I will make mad love to you. You don't say. <laughs> I'm in it. Let's go. Let's I am in the mood let's, for it. Let's go. <laughs> let's go. You so you're in a good mood today.
called the landlord to confirm if he got the rent. And he said he didn't send his boys to lock up the house. Bella. I planned rejection. You did what? Mm. Oh, so you think I will fold my arms until you are thrown out of this place? Oh, wait, wait a minute. Are, are, are you kidding me right now? So you mean that those tears, you, you, you staged everything? Brother, we don't parent. I be, we never parent. Hmm? Let me even ask you, was it that hard for you to get money from Vera? Hmm? I dare for me in holy holy, for me to be homeless. You lie. Hmm. To me, Ebuka. I love this. Ebuka. What? You were shouting Ebuka, Ebuka. Who is he? Me, shout Ebuka. Ah, Beba was screaming him, Ebu God, Ebu God, yes. But how does Ebu God and Ebuka sound alike? Ah, <laughs> come on. Ebu God, Ebu Ka, that's what you heard. Babe, is there anything I need to know? You see why I don't like doing this with you? You can see. Okay, it's fine. I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, Babe, please. I'm over it. I just said I'm sorry. Come on now. Babe, please. I am not doing this with you, please. Come on now. Is this little... Is... Please, Toby, please. Come on. Can you like frustrating someone every time? I love him, Vera. I love him. Well, I didn't know. I thought he was your toy, and I wanted to share. That's because you are selfish. Yes, you are so selfish, you cannot read between the lines of a fellow woman's actions, especially the one you call your best friend. How would I know? Eh? I encouraged you to go on with him. But you keep saying what he is, then who he is? So the best way to encourage me further is to sleep with him? <laughs> Emma, tell me, I mean, what's wrong in sharing, girl? Nothing. Really? Well, I hope that you share the same sentiments when I share your husband with you. You wouldn't dare. Oh, I will. And there is nothing you can do about it. What is wrong with you, Vera? Look at you. You are married to the most loving man on planet Earth. And what do I have? Nothing. Even my own mother thinks I am a disappointment because she has never seen any kind of love whatsoever in sight for me. 
And now the only man that really, actually cares for me, you stole from me. And now I have lost the contract all because of you. I hope you're happy. Babe, I'm sorry about that. How did it happen? Like you care. You know, I really should think that now that you found a rich and loving man that maybe you would stop all this, your whorish attitudes. But no, no. What am I even saying? You're not a whore. You're a bloody slut. How dare you! You have the audacity to hit me. You don't call me names while you're under my roof. I will sleep with your husband wherever, whenever, however I want. And there is nothing you can do about it. Because if you say Pim, I will spill on all of your slutty attitudes behind this back. <laughs> of course you have no evidence. Didn't you see Ebuka that day? That's not enough. Huh. How about maybe I've been recording all of your slutty conversations while we were speaking. How about that? Please, <laughs> please delete it. Eh? See, I will pay you any amount. No, please. No, no, no. You and I both know that money is not my problem. I want your husband, or I will play him this voice note. Emma, no, you can't do this. Eh? Really? You know how long we've been friends. Oh, you didn't know when you did yours? I thought about your shop. Baby, you're back. Hey, such a pleasure to see you. How are you, Emma? I'm good. Let me help you with that. How was work today? Huh? Fine. You look exhausted. How are you doing today? What, what mm -hmm. is going on here? Emma, are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. I'm just trying to feel your energy and see how you're feeling. Emma, stop! <sighs> Vera! You're here watching your friend assault me and you're not saying anything? Don't worry, I already spoke to her about it that I've really wanted you for a long, long time. And she's okay. Can you this. stop? Can I stop or ask her? Isn't it true? We can share? Vera? Yes. See? We are agreed on it. <laughs> I'm gonna stop this. Aren't we agreed on this? Vera! You're letting your friend do this to your husband? Vera, could you kindly tell your husband to just relax while I do what I want to do? Can you stop? him? Or? Uh, I, I said yes already. You see? Can you stop this? Vera, Emma, what is wrong with you? On. Vera, what is going on here? Emma, please, just, just... Stop what? Stop what? Baby... Please, allow her to touch you, just more. T touch me? Emma, what has come over you? Emma, I've always known you to be a very nice person. And I've been so nice to you. Why do you want to rob me into something I don't know anything about? Why are you harassing me sexually before your friend, my, my wife? Vera, are you allowing this? Because that's exactly what she does. Emma, you just have to stop this. Emma, Emma, talk to me right now. In that case, let your wife speak to you through her voice note. I love you. I'm finished. How would I know? Eh? I encouraged you to go on with him. But you keep saying what he is, then who is? So the best way to encourage me further is to sleep with him. <laughs> Emma, tell me, I mean, 
What's wrong in sharing, girl? Nothing. Well, I hope that you share the same sentiments when I share your husband with you. You wouldn't dare. That is exactly what I wanted to tell you two days ago when I left your house in tears. That's your wife. Your wife was having sex with my man in your matrimonial bed. Stop this! Stop what? Stop what, Vera? Baby, see, do not believe her. She's lying. Even your own voice. Vera, I asked you about this guy. You said he's your cousin. <laughs> cousin, co. Cousin, Nesni. I've done my part. I'll leave you two to it. Baby. Baby, she she's lying. Oh God, it, it, it it's the work of the devil. Baby. Retrieve the contract from her. There, there's no need for all that. Please send her the contract again. I beg you. Abby, please, can you can you do this for me? Forget all that Bella is telling you. It doesn't make any sense. She's just being childish. Eh? Please. I owe you one, I, I, I promise you. All right, thank you. Vera. Vera, do I deserve this? No, you don't. Vera, I loved you the best way I can. I raised your social status. I made you the envy of everyone in your circle. Baby, please. I'm sorry. I also opened businesses for you. I had capable hands to make sure you earn your own money without stress. Yet you never found me worthy of your love. Least of it, your sex. The same, the same sex, the same sex that I beg and fight for you to indulge me is what you give to another man freely in my house and on my bed. Baby, please, I'm sorry. I didn't I know. I don't know what! You don't know what, Vera? If I had gone to a hotel, fine. If I had done it outside this house, fine. But in my house and on my bed, Vera. Ah, Vera, you've stabbed me in the most fragile part of my heart. No. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Vera. Ah, women. <laughs> oh my god!
it. I'm coming. Who is it? Yes. Get out. Get out. Leave my house. Emma, we need to talk. I don't want to hear anything. Just leave my house! I mean, how long are you going to keep running? Run? From who? A bloody cab driver? Says a disgruntled, miserable 35-year-old single lady who would not have sex except she preys on a vulnerable cab driver. Dare you? How dare, dare you? To Get out of my house! Get out of my house! Hold of yourself. Leave my house. Now! Just go! Hey, 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 I, I'm sorry, okay? Listen, 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 I'm really sorry. Let me go! Let me go! You know what hurt me the most? That you slept with my friend the same day we had an argument. Meaning, you've always wanted to, but you were just looking for a reason to do so. Emma, I was devastated. Oh, wow. You said really demeaning things to me. I left here broken. Oh. I, I got out there and realized that my landlord had thrown my things away. Yes, I, I later realized it was my sister that orchestrated the whole thing so that I could end up with Vera, but it wasn't, it was no fault of mine. Wow. You know what? I don't care. I do not care. You are spineless and it is what it is. Leave my house. Emma, I love you. <laughs> Listen, I, I've always loved you. I loved you from the first day I set my eyes on you. Yes, I had my reservations because I thought I was just a bloody cab driver. Oh. And it was going to be difficult to get in a classy lady like you, but... So you know. Emma, can we just give love a chance? I'm ready. I would change jobs if you want. I would, I would double my hustle. I would do what I need to do just so I can have you. Please. You know what I don't understand? Upon what you did to me, you still somehow instigated my contract being terminated. How? Oh, that wasn't me. That was totally my sister. She spoke to my cousin, Abby, and told her that you were not willing to help me. Wow. Th that, that's just her being childish. Not knowing that you had actually offered to give me some of the money as soon as the deposit was made. Okay, let me understand this. So your cousin spoke to her boss to get my contract terminated because of you? Well, none of that matters anymore. I spoke to her this morning and Gosh. she is going to reactivate it. They're sending your contract today. You know what? I'm no longer interested. Please, I'm I am no yeah. longer interested. You have done enough. You have broken my heart, taken away everything that meant something to me. Just go. Just leave my house. Go! Get out. Get out! I don't want to eat your food. Look, are you okay? Is everything fine? Please, I want to be left alone. I'm here if you feel like talking. Our parents died. I have 
done everything within my power to give us a great life. Everything. I've taken really menial jobs with mega pay so I can send you to school, so I can send us through school. I have talked day and night just to put food on our table. And then I made just this one mistake and you will never forgive me for it. Was it my fault? Was it my fault that I was defrauded by the agent and that I landed in jail in, in Dubai? Just this one time you came through for me, I am no longer your hero. Just this one time. I told you. I told you not to go. How does that change anything? How does it change anything? I've, I've really done my best. I, I, and, and right now you, 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 you've pushed me into having sex with a, a, a married woman against my will. It's, it's, it, I said that's not bad enough now. I, I, I no longer have access to the love of my life. The person I really genuinely love, Emma. And you expect me to be happy? You, you want me to come back smiling? You want me to be happy? I'm so sorry. I didn't know you love her this much. I don't even know why I'm so unlucky. Why is my own case different? I'm so sorry, Ibuka. I was afraid of us being homeless. Ibuka, we are suffering. Vera made such a mouth-watering offer. I had to do what I felt was necessary to save us. I'm so sorry, Ibuka. I want you to know that even in luck, you will always be my hero. You're still my hero. I will do everything I can to reconnect you back to, to your lover. I'm sorry. Really sorry. You know, I know I took things too far. I shouldn't have. Emma, stop. Well, I actually came here to apologize and um, render my appreciation for what she did. Appreciation. Yes. I never really loved Toby. I married him for the wrong reasons. In fact, what we had was a wrong tie. Toby is such a good man and doesn't deserve to be treated in such way. He filed for a divorce. No. What have I done? I took things too far. I'm so sorry. Emma, I'm sorry too. Okay? I mean, how can I have my own man and and took the only one my best friend loves. 
No, it wasn't, it wasn't entirely your fault. It was my fault too. I, I didn't value him. I never took him seriously. No, but at least I would have pushed you to. That's what a good friend should do. See, I'm sorry. I do not want to lose my man and at the same time lose my dear friend. So, how are you doing? How are you coping through this divorce process? Well, we just began. You see, Toby is a good man and he's allowing me to keep all the businesses he opened for me. He said I once made him happy and he's never going to destroy that by allowing me to suffer. I keep saying that the world doesn't deserve that man. <laughs> oh. You know, I learned that um, money cannot buy love and attraction needed for one to stay married. Big lesson. Emma, hmm? you love him. Stop making things difficult for both of you. Go get him. I miss him. I really miss him. Yeah, I know. I mean, even if he's a cab driver, you can build him up and assist him financially. Like and if you need my help, I can always assist with loans without interest, no collateral. You would... <laughs> really? So now let's go get your man. <laughs> now? Of course now. See, I spoke to his sister and she wants both of you back. No, that's not true. That devil. No. She was just the spirit, trust me. Are you sure? I am very sure. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Now let's go get you, man. Good dress of changing to something. Else. Oh my god. Thank you. You're welcome, darling. Well, I please is there food in this house. I'm quite hungry. What is she doing here? Please calm down. Though. Don't ask me to calm down. I want her to leave this house this minute. Luca, you need to calm down. You need to stop being overzealous. She's the reason I lost Emma. I want you out. No, you did not lose me. What? Hi, Ibuka. Emma. May I come in? Of course. Please, please. I mean, you... You came to my house. Yes. I came to apologize for the nasty words I said to you. Ibuka, you are rare. You are intelligent, you're handsome, you're capable, lovable, and if I want to ever build my future with anyone, it would be you. If you want to. So does that mean that you would finally agree to be my girlfriend? Um... 
No. So? I was thinking about you being my man forever and ever. Never. Uh, um, Emma, the truth is, nothing has changed since the last time. Okay. It's still me, Ibuka, your cab driver. I still don't make a lot of money. I'm hoping to, I'm working on it, but I'm still here. I still drink Gary sometimes. I still orange sometimes. <laughs> I mean, but one thing is still sure. I still do love you so much. Are you sure you are willing to do this? Can you manage? Yes, she will. <laughs> I want to hear it from you. Yes, it will be my pleasure. I love you so much. I miss you. God. I didn't even realize that. 